Hey guys, today I'm going to be chatting with you about transforming your existence and raising your vibrational frequency through breath work. This is one of the key components to awakening the avatar, awakening the divine nature, and ultimately expanding consciousness. We're, first of all, I want to say this. Everyone is breathing continually, and yet so few seem to be breathing intentionally. There's an enormous difference between breathing and breathing intentionally. And to breath work is about learning to breathe intentionally. Continually breathing on the norm. In 2010, after my crazy uh, experience of 2010, the which I'm not going to go into right now, I think there's videos about it, but I began to, with every breath, I began to really breathe intentionally on a, on a much deeper level. And every breath seemed to create just a euphoric sense of enlightenment, a euphoric sense of a high, I would, I would lose my shit. I, I think I probably pissed my pants five or six times from 2010 to 2014, just in those four years, just because I was so high, I just lost my ability of my body to function on the norm. Now, that's what we call the high life, man, and that's, you can trip out like that as well. You can trip out on breath. There are so many different breathing techniques that will actually cause a real sense of euphoria and release DMT and anamides and all kinds of other beautiful neurotransmitters and chemicals and, uh, in our brain that, that are really vitally important to your existence. One of the things that scientists have believed for a long, long time is that your brain and so many functions of your brain and your hormonal system and the various systems of your body are autonomous. In other words, that you can't really do anything with them. They are the way they are and there's not a lot you can do. But really over the last 20, 30, and the studies have been going on longer than that. They just were, cons people that were doing them were considered heretics at the time. But the studies that have been happening now, and over the, especially over the course of the last 20 years or so, have really shown that you can change your, even your genetic makeup. That you don't have to be given genetically to cancer, or to diabetes, or to illness, or any of that. But that you can change not only your DNA, not only your genetic makeup, but you can change every aspect of your life through belief, through thoughts, through vibration. What I want to talk to you about today is really raising the vibration, the physical vibration. This is powerful. So I'm not going to go over a lot of different breath, breath, breathing exercises with you today. If you want to explore that, listen, there are tons of videos out there, you know, uh, from the Wim Hof method to... Um, lots of other videos. I've been exploring breath work for a long time and in 2010 I really started exploring it deeply. So in September we're going to be doing the metaphysical mindfulness class and there will be breathing exercises, some breath work along with lots of meditative practices and straight Eastern mindfulness. It's like a mindfulness class that you drop acid into. It's going to be an absolute trip. And that's starting in September. You can check it out at stasisinstitute.org. I'll drop the link below. Here's the deal. You just simply need to realize, if nothing else, that breath is life and life is breath. Try, I always tell people, you are the breath that is entering the body. You are not the body that is taking a breath. One of the very first things you need to, to know is this when you're practicing any breath exercise. You are the breath that is entering the body. You are not the body that is taking in the breath. And I tell people all the time, I said, try living without a breath. You can live without thinking. You can live, but you can't live without a breath. Breath is the most vital element of life. It's time for you 
to start breathing intentionally. So if there's one thing I want you to take away from this, and I might go into some other, the, there's Heaven's Mana video right here, it's one breathing exercise, but if I were going to take you on a journey of breathing exercises, I might do that in some of these daily trip videos later. For right now, this is the one thing I want you to know. I just want you to stop right here and just Just take a deep breath. Start breathing on fucking purpose. Breathe in, inflate your belly, and then inflate your chest. All right, one more practice and then I'm gonna let you go for the day. Lay down on the floor. Relax your body. And then practice breathing from your belly. So breathe, when you first breathe, so most people are just breathing unconsciously and they're just breathing with the top portion of their lungs. They're not breathing with the bottom portion. When you breathe, breathe in, your belly inflates and then your belly actually deflates as your chest inflates. So you can breathe with either part of your lungs. Most people are only using the top portion of their lungs. And so by laying on the floor in practice, you can, when you lay on the floor, you can actually get a sense of your belly inflating when you breathe and you can get a real good feel and a connection with your lungs and then start breathing on purpose. Throughout the day, set aside, uh, every time you think, every time you stop at a stoplight, at a stop sign, you get a phone call, just take a breath, take an intentional breath. It feels so good. I love you guys. Um, for Again, for more on this, on breathing uh, exercises and techniques, check out the Metaphysical Mindfulness class that's happening in September at Ecstasis Institute. And uh, if you haven't already subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. Hit the bell for notifications, man. Join me on these daily trips, and let's trip out together. I love you guys so much. Have a beautiful day.